Tonight, yet another letter from the principal. The second in two days has been sent to Roosevelt High School parents. The letter yesterday alerted parents to a threat called into the school, but that threat was deemed not credible. But today, there was a nearly two hour lockdown at Roosevelt. This time, a student reported another student had been seen walking down the hallway with what appeared to be a gun. It was also caught on school surveillance cameras. The gun turned out to be a fake rifle and a fake handgun, both plastic toys. But now three ninth graders, two 15 year old girls and a 14 year old boy are in some real trouble. Northeast ISD police charged them with making terroristic threats and they are facing what the district calls severe consequences. Many of the school's nearly 2700 students were allowed to go home with their parents after this ordeal was over. I was just hoping and praying that everybody would stay safe and no one will get shot or anything or nothing bad would happen. On KSAT.com, we have a copy of today's letter to parents from the Roosevelt High School principal. There was also a link to what happened at another Northeast ISD school earlier this month. A loaded 9mm handgun was quickly found after a student reported there was a gun on campus at Bradley Middle School.